Montgomery County is the third largest uh, county in Pennsylvania, which is the sixth largest state in the country. So um, anyone who's running statewide, be it Donald Trump, be it Pat Toomey, um, they uh, understand the importance of Montgomery County's 816,000 residents. When it comes to politics, Philadelphia County almost always swings Democratic. In neighboring Montgomery County, the race is closer, but still favorable for Democrats. But the Montgomery County Republican Committee is confident they'll do okay. Our idea of government, I think, is sort of independent of party lines. And I think also the way that we're able to get out the vote is different than the way that Democrats do. If we can keep the numbers down in, here in the southeast, uh, you know, maybe even help him, you know, win a county like Bucks or, or Chester. Uh, I think that uh, it's, it's definitely a winnable state for, uh, for Donald Trump. While the MCRC spends some time campaigning for the presidential ticket, most of their time is spent on local down-ticket candidates, such as Brian Fitzpatrick and Chira Smith. But the impact of Donald Trump's unpopularity on these types of races is surprising. When there's, it's a little bit more controversial at the top, it makes the, the, you know, the lower offices work harder for their own race. Now, there's no question it's been a divisive election season. However, there's at least one thing that both sides can definitely agree on. Get out there and vote, uh, regardless of, uh, you know, obviously, I'm hoping you vote Republican, uh, but, you know, your voice can, can count uh, in any election, and uh, make sure you get out there and uh, make it count. For Temple Update, I'm Brian Ziff.